Hi, my name is Natalie Adams and I'm a freshman here at the U of A. It can be very difficult for college students to spend a significant amount of time outside. However, it is very important for people to get outside to help themselves connect with nature. In the Nature Fix, William says, Aristotle believes walks in the open air clarified the mind. Darwin, Tesla, and Einstein walked in gardens and groves to help them think. Those names mentioned are some of the greatest minds we know, and it is shown how helpful it is in nature to improve mental states. For this project, I wanted to put outdoor spaces at the U of A campus to the test. I went to different locations around campus to study and relax, spending at least an hour in each location. I then rated each location based on how peaceful I felt it was and how beneficial it was to my learning. After doing that, I tried finding at least one U of A student in that location to interview and give their own rating to the location. So let's get into it. Okay, I'm down in Pacheco. I'm just relaxing and studying a little bit. And overall, it was pretty peaceful when people were in class um, and I was able to get a lot of work done, be outside, listen to the sound of the birds and um, just the people like walking around and the outdoor sound. Um, so overall, I think I'm gonna rate it like a seven out of 10 because when people come out of class, it gets pretty rowdy and it, it um, kind of obstructs my noise in surrounding areas um, and like the soundscapes, the natural soundscapes. So yeah. Okay, I'm here still and I found a U of A student. What's your name? Um, Evelyn. Okay, and what are you doing down here? Just studying, relaxing? Um, yeah, I'm studying for my upcoming FSHD exam. All right. And overall, um, out of 10, how would you rate this space that's beneficial to your learning? Um, I would probably rate it an eight out of 10. It's a little busy down here, but the atmosphere is very nice. Okay, and do you come out here a lot to study? Um, usually after class, yes. Okay, thank you. Okay, I'm outside of the main library doing some studying. Um, I've been out here for a few hours now and I found it really helpful. I really like being outside. Uh, of the library. There are a lot of people that kind of walk, but I feel like people tend to be a little quieter and things are more peaceful. When you're outside the library, I don't know if it's just the space or what it is. Um, I like to be in the sun and feel like the natural light on me when I'm out here working. Um, yeah, so overall, I think this is one of my better locations that I've been to so far this week. I would rate it an eight out of 10. Okay, I'm here with another UFA student. Uh, we're at the main library and she's studying outside. What's your name? Leonie. All right, and do you come to the library a lot to study? Yes, I do. It's okay. really fun. I really enjoy being outdoors and having the natural light and the natural sounds. Um, just, I love studying. All right, and our, for this location, out of 10, how would you rate it based on how helpful you think it is to your learning? A solid nine. Okay, solid thank nine. you. Okay, I'm outside on Greek Row right now, um, doing some homework and studying in the fresh air. Um, this is one of my favorite places on campus to come study. It's a really great spot, especially if you're in Greek life, to just come sit out in front of your house and um, <coughs> do your schoolwork, relax, anything. There's always people walking by to watch, um, so there's a lot going on. Um, so it can be a little distracting, but it's usually pretty peaceful. Um, right now there's a lot of people sitting outside that could just be because of the time of the year, but yeah. Um, I think that getting out on Greek Row to do your homework um, is a great spot to go to just kind of disconnect from campus or wherever you're living. So if you're in a fraternity or sorority, it's a great spot to go. Um, I sit out here for hours, so I would rate this location a 10 out of 10 if you can come to it. So, okay, yeah. I'm here on Greek Grove Hi-Fi with a U of A student. What's your name? My name's Brooke. Okay, Brooke, do you usually come outside here on Greek Grove to do your work? Yes, I always come out at my sorority house and lay in the sun and study or review some notes. Okay, and do you find it helpful to come outside to do your work? Yes, especially getting the vitamin D from the side is the best option. Okay, and out of 10, what would you rank this location to do your studying and relaxing? Uh, right now, I'd say it's an eight because it's kind of hot, but a few months ago, I'd say it's a 10 out of 10. Okay, thank you. Hi, 
so I'm outside at my dorm. It's like this out, outdoor area space. And it has these like chairs and then these like more picnic-y type chairs. Um, I think this is a great space to get outdoors. I really love this space. There's not anybody out here for me to interview, but um, this is by far one of my favorite spaces and I don't think people take enough advantage of the outdoor spaces that their dorms offer. So if you are a freshman, I would take uh, advantage of all the outdoor like courtyard areas that your dorms offer. It's a great space to come relax. There's not a lot of people here. It's open sky. You can just sit outside but still be on campus close to your room if you need to go somewhere. But it's a really great outdoor space to lounge, read, do homework, um, eat your lunch, all that. So I would give this a space a 10 out of 10. I come here all the time. It's by far my favorite place that I visited on campus while doing this video. Um, and I think more people should come out here and enjoy these spaces. So yeah, I, I really enjoyed this space and I had a fun time doing this project and I'm glad that this was my last location that I came to. After going to all these different locations, I rated my dorm location at the top. I loved all the locations I went to, but I felt this location allowed me to connect the most with nature without being distracted by other people or sounds. After interviewing people at the different locations, I found that most of them really enjoyed being outside and enjoyed doing schoolwork outside. However, this could have been because of the time of year that this interview took place and how nice it's been in Tucson. Having so many people be outside connects perfectly with our readings. As the Louvre mentions, a Danish study found that outdoor kindergartners were better than indoor schools at stimulating children's creativity. The researchers reported that 58% of children who were in close touch with nature often invented new games. Just 16% of indoor kindergartens, kindergarten children did. This quote is really helpful in understanding the benefits of being outdoors and how essential it is for people of any age, but especially college students to get outside. While we are in college focusing on school, it can be really easy to lose our connection with nature. So by doing this project, I hope people can see the importance of being in nature and how it positively correlates with our mental state and well-being. I encourage everyone to get outside for at least 30 minutes a day at any of these locations I visited on campus to help improve your connection with nature. Thank you.